welcome back friends. The time has come to make some changes in the lab, the studio, and changes to my life. So this is the Learjet Flight Simulator, a one-to-one -one Learjet 45 cockpit we built here on the channel over many years. It served its purpose well, but now we need this space. That works out pretty good for a completely random YouTube channel like this one, and projects like this Lear, but I need to clean the space up. I have a plan, I want to change some approaches to life, some approaches to the hobbies, and I want to have a nice little dedicated programming area. Coming up this spring I have a bit of a fun project but we need to drop some things from the air from our drones. Dropping something from the Mini is pretty hard but they do make this hardware for it. Dropping stuff from our big 500 heavy lifter is going to be much easier. We'll see what the range of this device is. It does have a pretty beefy little antenna and I believe it's 433 megahertz so we should get enough range for our project out of it. We can't go too far legally anyway. I hit up Amazon for a standing desk. I found this unit. It looks really nice, it works flawlessly, and the price was completely reasonable. After my day job, it's time to put some work into my websites. I'm not terribly good at web development yet. I do a lot of my work in WordPress. It's just simple and it just works, but I'd like to learn some proper web development and maybe remake this site from scratch. To do that, I think I need to train myself a little bit more, but we need some more hardware here to make things easier. If I'm going to be programming, I'm going to want the laptop at a little bit different height. We're going to want a nice mechanical keyboard, maybe a nice new mouse. To up the production quality of these videos, this arrived. I got a clapper and a Canon 90D DSLR. This replaces my 70D, allows me to do 4K footage, and the studio is complete with this. I can finally get the shots that I want. I have all the lenses. I was happy with the 70D, but the resolution just wasn't there. Elegoo sent me a new printer, the Neptune 4 Max. I didn't even ask for this. They didn't contact me. They just sent it over. Check out this hot end. What a monster. We need to get this assembled and try it out. To try it out, well, we've got lots of cool stuff to build, so let's use this.
anything that keeps me interested in a project and keeps me coding, keeps me working, even if it's just LEDs, is okay in my book. And I think it's worth the money spent if it's not too ridiculous. And this wasn't. still doing a lot of organization in the lab too and I found these awesome power connectors, signal connectors, whatever you want to use them for. They're the barrel style that comes on my soldering iron and I backtracked them to AliExpress and found multiple different pin versions. And they seem to be like an aviation style connector and they'll really do the job for a lot of projects. I just need something to get through a bulkhead or a side wall of a component. And these, I think, will be that. Of course, we file them all in the dollar store trays that I still have a few dozen empty ones. We should be set for a while. And today I start my journey in responsive web design, learning it from the ground up again, just like I did so many years ago, but learn it with modern CSS and modern methodology and see if I can get some of it to stick in my brain so that I don't need to use ChatGPT all the time. I have no intention of doing web development as a career. I'm quite content doing uh, the work that I'm doing, but in the evenings and for our own sites, such as the Make Me Lab channel site, the makeme.org or our Scent VR site, I think it would be really nice to be able to do my own coding and Free Code Camp is a great way for me to learn and I'm having pretty decent success at it, although sometimes I get pretty hung up. can't wait to put this to use in some of our projects like Scent VR user interface, but for now, I've got to put it away, got to get back to work, and I have some fun stuff to build for next video. 